Welcome, beautiful family, lovers of good things, lovers of important personnel all over the globe. I bring greetings from a grateful heart. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your time zone. Thank you for your love, thank you for your support. I just can't thank you enough. So, in this platform, we react to all videos and we give you all the latest updates. In fact, we draw the world closer to your desktop. So, please watch this video and I will be watching it with you. Don't forget, drop your opinion in the comment section and I'll be right back. Um. I said, me, Solomon, the name given to me by my grandmother, who I never even saw. With what I know, with what Mazin Namdekano have teach me, with what Simon Ekman have teach me, with what I learn through the agitators, through books, I swear down my life. Africa will never be better except we free ourselves from the mental slavery of the Europeans. You don't own Africa. None of you own Africa. None of you own Nigeria. Nobody will not get Nigeria. Oh my God. I, I stop. want to go to emotional. Please, Solomon, calm down. Calm down. Because I'm here to apologize. I'm not here to preach to you. I don't want to care who becomes your president. I don't care if you take Mazin Namdekanu there and say, let Mazin Namdekanu become your president. It will never be better. Because everybody that goes to that seat serves the interest of the Europe. They serve the interest of the British. Many of you don't know why Simon Ekma is crying all the time and say, we don't need to be free. Let me tell you something. I want to ask you something. If you give a monkey banana and try to take that banana bag, the monkey will fight you. There is no any presidency. There's nobody that goes to power in Africa that not that don't, that don't give their, their allegiance to the British and the Europeans colonists. I swear down with what I know. I don't read book. I don't go to school. I don't know why I know. I don't know why I know we didn't go to school. Man, I've read book. I've seen things. It doesn't matter. Tinubu is being your president. You want obedient. It doesn't matter who is there. Ask yourself one question I'm going to ask you. When Obi went to Europe, first of all, you have to go and meet their colonial masters. Oh, we not think saying I will get Nigeria. We not be will get Nigeria. You are not. You don't know Nigeria enough. The Europeans, the British people, the way you are, is the way they want it. They want to give you aid. Solomon, you are div you are diverging from what you want to preach. I'm here to apologize. I don't know why I'm preaching. I don't want to preach. I don't want to care who die. I don't care if the Europeans are killing the Igbos. I'm tired. I want to live my life. If now 80 years God won't give me, make I live and come out for this earth. I thought about my children. Let us give them a good life. I don't see people coming to social media and talk about the killing of Fulani all the time. I don't see them going to the street and protest because the Fulani are killing. Nobody does that. I don't see the so-called celebrities say anything. Cowards. They say cowards. Solomon, I will always believe in what I believe till I enter grave. I believe in pan-Africanism, which is love. I believe in revolution, which is love. I believe in freedom, which is love. This bunch of idiots for Nigeria, they think religion, religion will give you freedom. You are all slaves. Religion is worse than drugs. I said and I repeat without apology, religion is worse than drug. Because a religious man will never fight back when somebody comes to take what belongs to him. But somebody with drug addict, he will fight back and make sure there's blood on the floor. That's a man. All of you religion people. That is why I say you don't know where you're coming from. Go and check your histories. You are a Muslim. You are not an Arab. Arab be Muslim belong to the Arabians. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm here to apologize. I want to apologize. If you think what Simon Epa is doing uh, 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 is actually destroying Nigeria, I, 
which I don't think so, and many don't think so, I want to apologize. I, I think I want to apologize. If you actually think that what Mazin Nambikano was doing to save you people from mental slavery and from the colonists that never left Africa, that Mazin Nambikano is uh, actually, actually triggering war. I'm sorry, I apologize to all of you. I swear down, I apologize to all of you. I don't follow Mazin Nambikano because he speak English. I followed him because he speak the truth. He said the things that are in the book. He speak about history. He teach us about our past, where we are coming from. But we don't want to listen. 70% of the industry that you have in Nigeria belong to the British people. Now then get them. Forget say now, now they carry do chairman. I've told you guys before. When these people left Africa as a colonist, they never left. Those who represent them are there in Abuja. If you want to say something about free, don't worry, I'm sorry. I, I came here to apologize today. Please, I'm sorry. I don't care who become Nigerian president. I don't care who become OB. I mean, I don't care what happened to all of them again. I begin to think, why don't Solomon, why don't you enjoy yourself? Forget about these people. I'm not going to say, I'm not, I'm not here to say I don't believe in freedom. I still continue to support those who are, but I think it's high time I begin to enjoy myself. I'm leaving this country this year. And I was talking to somebody. I said, bros, I want to leave um, Israel. They said, where are you going, Solomon? I said, hey, bros, I don't know where they go, but I think I'm going to tour like three or four countries on a roll. I'm going to buy my ticket from this country. I go enter another country. I go go there, enjoy myself, follow there, enter another country. That, life no pass like that. It's not about drinking alcohol. It's not about, about sleeping with women. It's about knowing the world. You, you people think freedom is riding Ferrari? You think freedom is riding Ferrari? You think freedom is riding Mercedes Benz? You think freedom is marrying like three, four, five wives? Do you think freedom is building like 10 houses? When you don't have security, good road. I'm sorry if I if my mistake will they do. If my mistake will they do, I beg, I'm sorry. I before I go further, I want to apologize to all the Igbos in Yoruba land that their their businesses was destroyed, and it is not caused by me. I mean, Nami, me, I, I support Obi. Those of you who support Obi actually cause the problem. Because you live in a country, you call your own, but you are like a slave. You are all slaves in Yoruba land. Ibo, at the Teluna. I want to play you something. Let me just play you a voice. I want to play something. Just give me a minute. Give me a moment. I want to play something. This is actually from a Yoruba man. This video is yesterday, and I'm going to play it. A king from Yoruba land. I want to play it. Formula bring us to the end of this update. Do it to like this video, share, and subscribe. Thank you, and bye bye.